Hello everybody, it's Ms. Morgan at the Romeoville branch of the White Oak Library District and today I have a book talk for you guys. So the first book we're talking about is The Twelve by Cindy Lin. And The Twelve is about Usagi, who was born in the year of the Wood Rabbit, which means that she has these really cool powers that they call Zodiac powers. But she and her sister, who also has Zodiac powers, have to keep these on the down low because the Dragon Lord has actually been hunting down everybody who has Zodiac powers. So one day her sister is a little bit careless about her powers and her and her friend are both captured by the Dragon Guard. Usagi, however, is able to make it out and escape thanks to the help of three mysterious strangers who call themselves the heirs of 12. So now Usagi has to train and travel with the heirs in order to try to help save her sister and to possibly go up against the dragon lord himself. So the book has powers, it's all about the zodiac, it's got a great adventure, so if you like that stuff you want to check this one out. The next book we've got is Turning Point by Paula Chase. So Turning Point is about Rashida and Monique, who are both middle graders and best friends and good girls. For Rashida, this means keeping her friends really close and it means following all of her aunt's rules, including the ones about boys. But Rashida actually is in a secret relationship with Mo's older brother, but when that relationship starts to grow, she's finding it really hard to figure out the difference between good and bad decisions. For Monique, this means going with the flow at the prestigious and mostly white ballet program that she attends. But when the racial barriers holding her back make her have to choose between what she'll change to be successful, it's finding, she's finding it hard to see the difference between being strong and being weak. So this book is all about what you do when you feel like being yourself isn't good enough. So if you like contemporaries, if you like books that really talk about that kind of stuff, you really like Turning Point by Paula Chase. The last book that we have is The Unexplainable Disappearance of Mars Patel. And this book is about Mars who, when his friend goes missing, gets his group of detention buddies together to try to find her. But their, their talents are only going to get them so far because they're finding that people, kids, are going missing actually all over the world. And this mostly has to do with an elite school that is create that was created by Oliver Pruitt, who in this book is one of the most powerful men in the world and was actually Mars's idol for a really long time. So it's them trying to solve this mystery and this one's really cool because it's actually based on a podcast and when you're reading there are lots of instances of them actually including transcripts from the podcast itself. So if you like that, if you like books that have to do with that kind of multimedia uh, spin, if you like that kind of stuff, and this one is also the first in a new mystery series. So if you like mysteries, you'll really like this one as well. So that's The Unexplainable Disappearance of Mars Patel by Sheila Chari. All right. I hope you guys like this book talk and we'll see you next time. Bye.